just glad you're okay. What happened anyway? You're too good of a pilot to just crash like that. That was a test run using a new prototype propulsion system. It's got a few bugs to iron out. Why not just use my plane, the Tornado? Thanks, but you gotta check out my newest power supply. Ta-da! Whoa! A Chaos Emerald! Yep, I just happened to find one of the seven emeralds during one of my test flights. This thing's got unlimited power, you know. So I figured, why not use it to power my plane? Supercharged! You gotta come over to my workshop, Sonic. I've got something I've gotta show you. It's in the Mystic Ruins. The fastest way is by train. Let's go! So yes, Tails is still annoying, just as annoying in this game as he is in the classics. Hey everybody, it's Ultimate Lifeform Prototype here, and I'm still playing Sonic Adventure for you guys. So, last part, we started off the story with Sonic, and we, um, did Emerald Coast. Pretty fun level. But you say so well. for the Mystic Ruins will be departing soon. Uh, so, yeah, like, like I just said, Tails is still just a story in this game, and he screws you over a lot. Not, not necessarily as much in the classics, but, I mean, he still screws you over a lot. And I'll be yelling at him a lot during this Let's Play. So, turn down your volume. <laughs> if it isn't Sonic! Look, it's a giant <laughs> <Sonic> <laughs> It's me, Eggman! <laughs> It'd be so funny if Eggman had a uh, you say, Mario Eggman. voice. Enough. Italian I voice. I always pictured it was one of them. I don't know why. You're always up to no good. Now what do you want? I want all of the chaos emeralds. Although I do like Tails' oh. voice in this game. It it's it suits him pretty well, I think. I, I like that one, but it's it's still annoying. Oh, shut up. Please. Sorry, that was me my, fixing my mic. My mic is so weird right now. It's like I'm gonna get a new one, but it's like lopsided. You have to like turn it around and put it on the back of your head. It's pretty weird. Uh, Alright, so yeah, this is our second boss. The Egg Hornet. Yes, the Egg Hornet indeed. And, you know, not really much to say. Missiles, you know, it's pretty cool. 3D missiles? Uh huh. It's so revolutionary. Well, at that time it was, I guess. The Sonic games, at least. Um. Yeah. This is a boss fight. Kind of. Not really. You're not getting away with this. There's so many infamous lines in this game. It's it's not even funny, I can just think of a million, and most of them are from Eggman. Uh Oh well great, right, now I can't think of them, now I look like an idiot. Um okay, well you're not going to get away with this and he's not going to get away with this. I think he said both. Um uh, Do you think you can make it here, Sonic? You know, other ones. I'm sorry. Usually remember able to remember all of them. I can remember one from Shadow. It says the D word. Yeah. Involving four chaos emeralds. <laughs> oh, that looks dirty what Eggman is doing right now. Well, that wasn't so hard. <laughs> no, oh, no Tails you see, Tails is just weak. It doesn't do anything. Ever. Just lets him take the chaos on I mean, then again, Sonic actually does that a lot in this game too, but it's whatever. Eh. Oh yeah, this is the part where we find out that chaos has many different forms. I mean, you probably already knew that when it said chaos zero, but I don't know. See, what 
Eggman does, he feeds him a Chaos Emerald, and the Chaos Emerald goes inside him, and then he, his limbs, like one of his limbs gains bones, like that, and then he gets bigger and stronger. So, I thought that was a pretty good idea. Not necessarily original, but cool. Because there's one thing in Dragon Ball GT where uh, Omega, this guy named Omega Shenron uses Dragon Balls. Well, they're kind of like negative Dragon Balls to kind of level up a little bit. It's a little bit the same. But I'm not sure if that was actually before this or not. Um, but I know Dragon Ball was. Why am I talking about Dragon Ball in the Sonic Adventure playthrough? Shouldn't be doing that. We can't let him get away with this, can we? No, no dip! Without more emeralds, the monster can't transform. So, it's up to us to get the emeralds before Eggman does, huh? <sighs> Alright. Well... Okay. So, what you want to do here is just bring this stone up here, down here, Jump off this. Hopefully not die. No, nope, we're good. Sonic physics. Bring it into this tunnel. And bada bing bada boom. Yeah. Alright. Now, oh, Windy Valley is a pretty fun stage. For some reason, like, I just remember getting stuck in so many parts in this game, including this level. And I don't know why. I just did. Don't blame me. I don't know why. Yeah, I used to suck at Sonic games, but now I'm pretty good at them, actually. Spin Dash! Yeah, you'll probably notice that you like to use the Spin Dash a lot in this game. Well, uh, if I ever do it, which I probably will, uh, do a Let's Play of a classic Sonic game, I spam the heck out of the Spin Dash. Almost always, except for Sonic CD, because the spin dash sucks in that thing. Head straight up. You should be able to get oh. out of the tornado. Thank gosh they have a figure eight in that game. Because that game would not be as good. Wall jump, wall jump, wall jump. Triple E, triple E. Triple E. Alright. Ah, oh, Tails are so slow. Come on. Shortcut. Yeah. You know, it's time like these when I really appreciate the view in a Sonic game more than I do the gameplay. Which is hardly ever. Thank you. 